good afternoon everyone uh, this is my reporting about the classifications of euthanasia so voluntary euthanasia is where a person's life is indeed at the request in order to relieve them of suffering next is non-voluntary euthanasia of course when the person is unconscious or otherwise unable for example a very young baby or a person or of extremely extremely low intelligence to make a meaningful choice between living and dying and an appropriate person takes the decision of their behalf next is involuntary euthanasia of course when euthanasia is performed on a person who would be able to provide informed consent but does not either because they not want to die or because they were not asked next is passive euthanasia is when death is brought about by an omission, i.e. when someone lets the person die. This can be drawing, withdrawing, withholding, or treatment. Withdrawing treatment, for example, switching off a machine that is keeping a person alive so that they die of their disease. And the last is active euthanasia. Active euthanasia is when death is brought by an act. For example, when a person is killed by giving an overdose of painkillers. Passive euthanasia is when death is brought about by an omission, when someone lets the person die. So, that's all. Thank you. Bye.